In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. May the love of God the Father, and the grace of the only begotten Son, and the indwelling of the Holy Spirit be with you always. Amen. My name is Father Gattas Kuri, pastor of Our Lady of the Rosary, Sacramento, California, and the pastor of St. Sherman Mission in Stockton, California. It's my joy to share with you today the Gospel of the third Sunday week of the Resurrection Tuesday. The Apostle John says, so the crowd said to Jesus, what can we do to accomplish the works of God? Jesus answered and said to them, this is the work of God that you believe in the one he sent. So they said to him, what sign can you do that we may see and believe in you? What can you do? Our ancestors ate manna in the desert as it is written, he gave them bread from heaven to eat. So Jesus said to them, Amen, Amen, I say to you, it was not Moses who gave the bread from heaven. My Father gives you the true bread from heaven. For the bread of God is that which comes down from heaven and gives life to the world. So they said to him, Sir, Give us this bread always. This is the truth. Peace be with you. It's a beautiful gospel. Always give us hope. Especially give us this bread always. We are hungry to your bread, O Lord. We are hungry to see our people around us celebrating with joy the divine liturgy at the occasion of your resurrection. We thank you for everything, even though we are in isolation, but always the fervent of resurrection is with us as St. Paul and Sila when he was in prison. The destiny to be in jail, but the next day they were released because they proclaim the praise of the Lord during the night of their place, in their place. This daily bread is our essential bread is the one who stir up the fire inside of us and give us the peace and the tranquility as Jesus promised his disciples in Holy Thursday and Easter Sunday evening he accomplished what Jesus promised he accomplished first his peace and tranquility. No one could take it away from the disciples. And also he breathed on them the Holy Spirit. That means they receive the bread of life. They receive it was a memorial uh, in Holy Thursday, but it became a fact right now. Effectivity of the bread of life. When we receive it, we, re we receive the resurrected Jesus Christ. Therefore, always there is a source here in the church. If you people, they receive this living war, 
and the others they are at home. And for many occasions, especially for Corona. But, O oh Lord, continue to help your people to have their joy wherever they are and let them celebrate your resurrection even though they were isolated from your place. Always we are hungry to your daily bread. Amen.